just made some breakfast. Got some toast with peanut butter and eggs with ketchup. And I made myself a banana raspberry uh, smoothie with oat milk. I hope you guys are doing well. It has been really a crazy couple of weeks with the coronavirus and everything that is going on around us. I hope you guys are staying safe and healthy and just being cautious and just like taking the extra steps to take care of yourself and your body every day. It is actually my spring break. Samson and I originally wanted to go to Orlando. It kind of sucks because it is my last spring break. Um, it's my last semester. I really did want to do something, but you know, obviously it's better to be safe and there's always other times that we can go. So this week I am probably just going to be staying home at the end of the day i just hope you guys are staying safe and staying healthy and i hope that you know my videos can maybe take your mind off of everything that is happening for just a little bit and bring a little bit of joy to your day i will be continuing to upload content at least once a week um like i normally do i don't think anything is going to change with that on a lighter note kobe is super happy because samson and i are home a lot to spend with him <laughs> just filmed a video i am about to make some breakfast right now and i'm gonna show you guys like my go-to breakfast these days i kind of alternate it but it's around the same thing some of you guys had asked to see more cooking and stuff um in my vlog so i thought what better time than when i am self-quarantined so today i am going to be making some eggs um a grilled cheese and also some fruits coffee and some tater tots i am going to start with the tater tots first i got these from whole foods just preheated the oven and now dropping these in i'm gonna cook them for about 15 minutes also just quickly scrambling some eggs okay now i'm gonna show you guys how i make my grilled cheese it is so so good i'm pretty sure this is how everybody makes it basically I have two pieces of bread and i am going to use some butter and butter um one side of it so because the butter was in the fridge um it is like kind of solid like it's not melting but it's okay once we put it on the pan um it's gonna melt and then using like a flat pan like this i am going to put the bread on with the butter side on the pan so like this oh no my butter it's fine <laughs> here like that let it cook for a little bit i kind of just like put the butter on the pan so that it goes kind of like on the bread as well so then for cheese i really like using shredded cheese but this is basically what it's gonna look like and i'm gonna put this on top my butter Okay, now for the coffee. I've been really liking this. All I have to do is just boil some water and then I just pour it in. Let's check on the tater tots. Pretty sure they are ready. All right, guys, so this is what it is. Um, we got some grilled cheese, some mandarins, some tater tots, and finally some eggs. Oh, and then also my coffee. I had filmed this morning, so this is like a brunch for me now. I'm so hungry. Here is a little close-up. Ooh, the tater tots look so good. These scrambled eggs, grilled cheese, and some fruit. Taste test. Mmm. 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 <laughs> All right, you guys, today is the day. I am going to tackle my closet. Here it is. It is very, very cluttered. We are home all week, so I am going to do some spring cleaning. I'm going to get rid of some clothes, um, either sell them if they are in great condition or I'm going to donate them after you know this is all over and we're able to go out again. I have a bunch of clothes over there. In the back is boxes with my summer clothes, so I'm just gonna leave that for now. And then I have all of this. <laughs> it's so messy, I can't 
and then I had down here which is like just sweats and stuff in here I have like my bags a lot of them I don't use anymore so I'm either gonna put them away or sell them or something and then I have all my shoes Ugh, just so much stuff that like it is so cluttered so yeah this is my goal for today I don't know how much of it I can do today and I will show you guys what I end up with at the end of the day All right, you guys, I literally just spent hours <laughs> organizing and trying to get rid of things, cleaning out my closet, and I finally did it. It is pretty much done. Um, let me show you guys. So this is the closet. This took me so much time because I put away a lot of like my thicker sweaters that were hanging before and I put them in the back already. So when it starts to get warmer, I'm gonna put the other thicker ones like these, like the thinner turtlenecks and stuff. I'm gonna put them away, but I left a few just in case, you know, it is going to get chilly still. Up here, I decided to put all my pants. So these are like my lighter pants, my other color pants, and then my black pants basically. And over here, it is all arranged by color. Got my blacks, my blues, my grays, my like greenish, brownish colors, cooler browns, my warmer browns, my whites. I have some sweaters that I left out just in case, you know, it does get cold. And then in here are all of my clothes that I wear at home, hoodies, sweatshirts, stuff like that. So I stored away some of the coats that I'm not going to wear anymore. Um, and then I'm also donating some other ones. They're like both mine and Samson's. And then I organized my jeans. These are the ones that I wear the most, the ones that I grab once in a while. And then I have my skirts, workout stuff. I have a bunch of stuff that I am throwing away. And then here are the things that I am donating. And this is usually where I put the stuff that I'm selling. I have a lot of items that I need to take pictures of so that I can post it on my Poshmark. So I actually posted that I was like cleaning out my closet today on my Instagram stories. And a lot of you guys asked me to kind of talk about it, um, like how I cleaned it out and stuff like that. And basically my method is that if I didn't touch it in the last couple of months i you know get rid of it if it is still in really good quality like i only wore it once or didn't even wear it at all then in that case i will be selling it on my poshmark but as you guys know i do get sent some things as a content creator a lot of the times i don't even get to wear it more than once like just for a shoot or something um and in that case i would just end up donating it because you know somebody else can definitely have better use so that's usually like my rule of thumb and i usually do a closet clean out um once i switch out like my winter and my summer stuff so at the end of summer when i do a closet clean out i get rid of all the things that i didn't touch at all that summer or only like barely touched and i know that you know by next year i'm probably still not going to so then i get rid of those and then when i take out my fall and my winter stuff i look through it see you know what i want to keep and at the end of winter when i'm taking out more summer spring stuff i do another clean out so <laughs> i do a lot but also you know obviously i don't have a lot of room so i try not to keep too many things so yeah i hope that is helpful i am so happy that i cleaned this out today if you guys are in self-quarantine and you have nothing to do try cleaning out your closet it's really annoying to tackle at first but once you're done oh my god like it's just such a huge sign of relief it's like that annoying thing that just like always keeps pestering me like telling me oh you should clean out your closets but then i get really lazy and when i finally do i feel so good about it it is quarantine day i don't even know but i'm making some dinner right now i thought i would show you guys what i'm making i'm doing some stir fry with rice i'm gonna stir fry some celery and uh, beef sausage and then stir fry some tomatoes with egg which is like a pretty traditional like chinese dish and then i also am just steaming some broccoli i did a instagram live today and a lot of you guys tuned in so thank you so much for watching my instagram live it was actually like my first time doing it so i was a little bit 
I don't know, just like nervous, but I really love just interacting with you guys, answering your questions, and um, I'm thinking about doing it maybe like once a week or just like more often in general. All right, so I'm gonna start with the tomato and egg, and basically I just break the egg. I have four in here it's for both me and Samson, and like if we have leftovers, we'll just eat that tomorrow. Okay, just put in a little bit of olive oil, and I'm just gonna put the egg in first. I wait for the egg to kind of like cook a little bit but not fully and at this point I am going to take it out into the bowl and then using the remaining oil I'm going to dump in the tomatoes all right now like a minute later you see how it is a lot softer there's like some tomato juice out and I am going to pour the egg in putting a little bit of soy sauce for like flavoring. Okay, and there you have it. Now I am stir frying the celery and um, the sausage. Really, really easy. This I just put in all together with a little bit of olive oil. Stir fry it. I am going to add a little bit of soy sauce. And then I'm gonna add sesame oil. I love sesame oil, so I put it in like almost everything. What are you doing, Oh, I don't think this was a good one. Why? I don't know. <laughs> We've been just taking Polaroids of our time in quarantine, kind of documenting the days. Got the tomato and egg, the sausage and celery, some steamed broccoli, and rice. Samson is over there playing his games. I have been kind of losing my mind being at home all day, honestly. So I decided today I'm going to just kind of move my body, stretch a little bit. I haven't been able to work out or anything, obviously, because the gyms are closed. So um, I actually ordered a yoga mat so I can do like home exercises. It's not gonna come in until later this week, but that's okay. I am just going to use my floor <laughs> in the meantime and um, just do some stretching and some light workout. I actually don't have like any equipment. I do have some resistance bands, which I will use and I don't have dumbbells. So I'm just using <laughs> this like water jug in the meantime. Down, yeah. I've been feeling so, I've been feeling so down, yeah Can you tell me why, can you tell me why I'm down, yeah No friends of mine, no friends of mine around, yeah Now I'm thinking I, now I'm thinking I Might have caught the June blues, yeah I wanna 